But we are supporting a friend in it. So, yeah. And there's terrible traffic here. Uh, no. We brought my soda back with us because 38 degrees outside. Traffic. Ah. So the roads now are like empty. Yeah, isn't that crazy? It was packed on all the side roads, and now these are completely empty. Look at all of the trash on the road. Is that from like water balls and stuff? Yeah, that's from the race trash. People drop in their jackets because it's so cold out. People are dropping their jackets and their ponchos stuff like that and it just totally litters up the race. Look at all that. But now we're coming into Epcot. You would think Wait. we are back in Minnesota. It is crazy cold this morning. We had to put our hats on, our gloves on, Scarf long johns on, Scarf overcoats. On. I think we wear overcoats in Orlando once every like five years. <laughs> it's crazy cold this morning. And as you saw when we pulled in, all the runners had to have been freezing and had all these layers, ponchos, you know, garbage bags, things like that on and Cut just stripped them as they ran because it's that cold this morning. It had to have been miserable on the runner. So good for you if you ran the Disney Marathon good today because you. it's cold out. It's very kind of quiet this morning. But here's the entrance to the Run Disney. They have like all the different nonprofits. Do you think it's getting warmer? My fingers don't say that's true. My fingers are still numb. My fingers are frozen. <laughs> like, I feel okay. Do you know what we forgot? What? Our cowbell. Aww. So we could annoy everybody. Yeah. Yep, porta potties, lots of porta potties. <laughs> and they're all open for me. Yay! Stretch the cow! special line for annual pass holders now that are supposed to kind of eliminate some of the long lines at the parks. We're in line for that one, but it's so busy today with the marathon and they don't have very many gates open. Even the pass holder line is like super, super long. So we came inside Epcot. We met our friend, cheered him on and decided to come over to Epcot and cheer some more people on. So cool to see all the runners. We came over to France to get some breakfast and the runners are coming through. They enter way over by um, United Kingdom. So it's kind of cool to see them come over the bridge and go around this way. High five, high five! Coming into the end! And they're right at six hours and Belle came out to cheer them on which is really cool. So we're gonna come to the pastry place to get some breakfast. <laughs> right there, the first word right over there, that means bakery in French. There you go, in French. Bakery, oui oui. It is nice and warm. Warm in here, toasty warm. Why are we so excited? No line. <laughs> All right, I'll follow you, Miss No Line. Oh, and it smells so good. I wish you guys could have smell-o-vision. Yum. <laughs> She's like, what do I get? What do I get? Look at all the yummy stuff. Question. Can I get a dessert and a lunch? <laughs> 
I think it's like breakfast. Isn't it breakfast time? Look at all of the desserts. Yum. 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 Yum, yum, yum. For your macaroons. I know the macaroons are like really good. Aren't the macaroons your favorites? Yeah. Yeah, but I always get those. Oh, are you going to try something different? Oh. Trying to stay healthy, I ended up getting a quiche, which is a quiche the rain. I got a little healthy. Hunter got a croissant. What is it you got? Um, I got a croissant blah blah. <laughs> well, this, no, croissant, no, what is this one? A That's macaroon. a macaroon. But with like strawberries and stuff on it? It's basically just a bigger macaroon. Oh. And then it has like strawberries and stuff in it. <laughs> so what was your croissant thing again? Croissant blah blah. Yeah. We asked her like three times, how do you pronounce that? And finally it's like, okay, croissant, blah, 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 blah. Like watermelon, watermelon, watermelon. You're doing great, keep on going. There's Jasmine and Aladdin in Morocco. This is really cool. We're coming into the American Adventure and you've got a whole cheer group over here with the American flag. Oh, it's the cast members. That is awesome. As you know, Epcot has the Food and Wine Festival and the Flower and Garden Festival and then this year over the holidays, they had a taste of the holidays. They love food at Epcot. Well, you know what? They're adding one more little bit of food. They're adding this. Epcot International Festival of the Arts. So January through February, and it's basically kiosks with food. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you say a like, subscribe to me. So I'll see you guys in another video. Bye. Keep on dreaming. Love you all.